This 350-year-old masterpiece by Rembrandt was one of George Eastman's prized possessions, but there was a time when its stewards in Rochester feared they'd lost it for good. On January 31, 1968, two thieves removed it from the living room wall of the George Eastman Museum and made off into the night. News 8 was there while investigators brushed the wall for fingerprints and the museum director talked about the stunning heist. This picture is so very well known. It's listed on all the books on Rembrandt that whoever tries to sell it will have a very difficult time doing so. Police believe the thieves hid in the Dryden Theater and when the museum closed for the night, snuck down the hall and made their move. A guard discovered the theft the next morning. I believe they walked right out the front door once they were inside. It was cut out of the frame, and the frame was actually found right by our fence in the back in the parking lot. The painting was recovered nine months later in Plattsburgh when three men tried to book a private flight into Canada. They were arrested, and the painting was eventually returned to Rochester. Today, it's on display at the Memorial Art Gallery, an authentic Rembrandt back in its rightful place. This piece at the George Eastman Museum is a replica, hanging in the same room where the original was stolen 50 years ago.